Let me see if I can get that open again. All right. But we now, what was I saying? Oh, I was saying we really have to turn those down with the ball valve because they, I mean, it'll really spray. And uh, you have to get that adjusted just right so that the siphon loop works. It takes a little bit because you don't want too much coming in here. Uh, it, it's got to work. You have to have enough for the pressure coming in for the siphon to work, but then you don't want too much so that the siphon needs to suck air and break the siphon at the end of the cycle. So it just takes a bit of adjusting to do. So I know that you'll do great. Uh, now, um, on this T right here, let me see if I can go this way. There's another connector. Hopefully you can see that. Um, the five inch water hose. Uh, and uh, the brass connector and another special connector that connects it to this T, just the other kind, and that's how I've made the siphon loop with that connector. So I think that's all that was on the paper that you sent me, at least as much as I can provide with information. Uh, let me know what you do, send me a video. Send me some pictures or write it out. Tell me what you're doing. I'm interested in what you're doing. It sounds great. And uh, I hope everything works out well for you.